This is the online version of our daily newsletter, The Morning Win. Subscribe to get irreverent and incisive sports stories, delivered to your mailbox every morning. Charles Curtis is filling in for Andy Nesbitt. OK. As some readers may know, I'm a die-hard New York Knicks fan who has spent some time on for the win writing about the franchise and the roller coaster life of rooting for this franchise. So of course I came into the 2022 NBA draft feeling hopeful that they could find a hidden gem with the number 11 pick, maybe a future key rotation piece at the very least. And then, a lot happened, and it was confusing for a while. Did they trade for Memphis big man Jalen Duran, a player they didn't necessarily need? And then they dealt him away to the Pistons with Kemba Walker and his large salary? It was all sorts of weird and our trade grades reflect that. New York ended up with some future protected first rounders and selected one player in the second round, Duke's Trevor Keels, and, here's the fun part, cap room. And we've done this dance before. In recent years, the Knicks have maneuvered to make room for a big name free agent or two. What happens then? Guys like Kevin Durant say no thanks, 